Good morning guys and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a day in the life vlog. So it is 5 past 10 in the morning and um, it is Thursday the 16th I think it is of April um, and um, yeah I have my breakfast on. Ava is down here eating toast and playing um, a game on her iPad and Robert just got out of the shower. So um, today the immediate thing that we're gonna do as I said I'm gonna make my breakfast but after that we will get dressed and we're going to go and walk the dog um, so basically what we do is yeah we'll see and um, because there's three dogs in Robert's parents house so basically what we do is um, we ring and we say that we're coming to collect a dog because could they get the harness and all that sort of stuff on um, So we go um, myself and Ava stay inside the car Robert gets out of the car Robert's, um, Robert's mum passes over the dog to us um, and that's basically what happens we give kind of like like a quarantined Passover <laughs> of the dogs um, so for the first couple of days we were just bringing our own dog which is Snooky, which is the red setter yeah. yesterday we brought um, their Pugalier I think it is it's a King Charles and a pug a um, mixture of it um, called Max so I think it's just gonna be the two of them today because they have another yeah. small Bichon freeze dog but I just we just don't think that he's she's going to want to walk at all you can't really see it's dark over there um so that's the crack that's what's going to happen this morning after we're all fed and watered and all that sort of stuff and then we will see what happens for the rest of the day sorry no she never wants to drink after her walk does she no maybe not talking maybe maybe we'll see if she's thirsty today will we Maybe go yucky one in game. Okay, yeah, no, let's stop talking with food in your mouth. So we are ready to go out. So myself and Ava have put on some sun cream. So the same as all the other years, we've been using the La Roche Posay one. So it is um the 50 plus the wet skin technology. Oh, wait, wait. So we put that on. If it has it on her face, I have it on my chest. Um and we oh. bought this the other day um because you're only supposed to have them open for 12 months um, and sun cream is something that you kind of want to actually do what it says on the tin you know because if it goes off it's, you're probably going to get burnt and that's just not worth it especially with our pasty white skin we get all burnt won't we so when we come back I need to have a shower but um, then, oh yeah, something that I want to talk about is the weather. So let me know how the weather is where you live um, down in the comments. So just take the moment now down in the comments just to kind of talk about the weather. But basically for the last week or 10 days, it's been sunny. It's been um, mid to high teens, which is good here. Um, and the only day that wasn't good was Easter Sunday. It was raining all day on Easter Sunday. Um, but I think tomorrow the weather is supposed to break and um, that's what's showing on my app anyways Friday Saturday and Sunday they're gonna be rainy days um, and you know it's kind of like a welcome reprieve because it you know it stops people going out because we our lockdown has been extended until May the 5th um, here in Ireland so um, you know I sh I'm sure the government are like praying for rain because it will keep people inside and this weather here people are you know they're breaking the rules they're going out to meet up not everybody there is a high level of compliance and um, which is good but let me know what it's like in your area um especially the weather you know um because usually in April in Ireland it rains you know the April showers and all that sort of stuff that's usually through here but no now that we're in lockdown it's not so uh another thing i want to tell you is that we have to collect our washing from robert's mom and um, basically a couple of weeks ago two weeks <laughs> two weeks ago our um, washing machine just stopped working so and um, i would have said that on instagram if you follow me over there so i contacted my um 
landlords and they basically said that because of the current restrictions that it's not an emergency um, that they can't come out and fix the washing machine and then when I queried how we're going to wash our um, clothes they just said well I'm, I think laundrettes are open but luckily we live in the same town as our parents so we can just kind of drop them off at the door they take them in and they wash them first and we collect them the same way So we go out now, go walk the dogs. You, you're quiet now that you're on the camera. A minute ago you were all loud, weren't you? Shatterbox. Remember the days I used to say we never talked? She talks loads now. She talks loads now. <laughs> So the clip I just showed you there was Ava doing her dance class. So um, dance class obviously finished when the restrictions for the coronavirus finished. Um, but her dance teacher has been holding like classes on Zoom. Um, and yeah, basically Ava was not into, into it at all. It started out okay, it ended pretty quickly. Now we, we did the duration of the class, but it took a lot of convincing for her to actually do it. She was not at all into it today. Um, she kept saying she's so tired and all this sort of stuff, but now she's gone out with Robert um, to run around for a bit. I think they could be going to the car park. Um, but yeah, like, you know, she just wasn't into it. She kept saying she was tired and this and that and this and that, but realistically, she just didn't want to do it, you know? Um, and that's okay, I suppose. But, you know, it's only one a, one a week. And I, I want her, she loves dancing, like when we were going to dance class, she loved it. Um, so I wanted to keep her going with it. But every time we've done the Zoom class, she's just not that into it. Um, and it's because, she, you know, she has us here and she bosses us around. <laughs> Especially Robert, she bosses him around and he lets her get away with it where I would be more strict with her. Um, but he's been off for three weeks now and... Um, 
yeah you know she just rose to roost for him um that's a definitely like a daddy daughter type relationship um so yeah i need to have a shower at some stage i also need to make the dinner we're making spaghetti bolognese um i went through my um what we kind of want for the next week or so but i do need to go through my pantry so i might do a whole big video on that um after i have a wash <laughs> or maybe even tomorrow because i'm not buying anything today if you follow my budget channel which i'll have linked below you will know that i basically spend money every single day and you're only supposed to go out for essential items and stuff but i find myself because i live in the center of the town like just popping to the store for a couple of things which is completely not what you're supposed to do so um today i made a vow that we're not spending any money today um tomorrow we may have to spend some money but definitely on saturday uh, if we don't tomorrow so either tomorrow or saturday i'm gonna have to go to the grocery store to pick up um the final bits that we need um because we, we've run out of lots of things um, but I will do a video on it, I think, and um, kind of just share with you the insight of how I'm going about um, and trying to save money because we've been, I don't know about GE, you, but our grocery budget has just been blowing the last couple of weeks <laughs> since this whole quarantine thing. Um, so yeah. Right now I'm going to record a video for my budget channel. I'm going to record our paycheck budget. So basically today is Thursday and Robert got paid his paycheck and then I just do a video on what we're going to put that towards. And I also run through um, the actual figures from last week as well um, and share where the money went and um, why it went to that particular thing. So that's the video I'm going to do now and upload. So something that I do want to show you guys, if you remember in a couple of videos, a couple of daily lives ago, maybe three, four of them, um, I shared that we were going to be planting seeds and all that sort of stuff. So I just want to give you a little update on how that has gone. So I also bought some um, just flowers I seen in Lidl one day when I was doing my shopping and um, so I have a couple of them there just to give a little bit of greenery to the area while we're stuck inside our house mostly there's also lots of seagulls around I don't live near the sea anyways um so I'll show you how my seeds are doing um I'm actually pretty happy because they do have like little um buds coming up so So this is the one that we planted and you can see there's like little green bits coming up. This is also was one, I won't touch it, but um, some of them are sprouting really, really good. So we kind of wrote this around a lot. I also then planted this, which I'll put on, um, when it starts to bloom, I'll put on the grave and then these are the ones that i bought so this one here and this one here they're from last year and they were completely dead but i just cut back all the dead bits and i noticed that there was new um blooms coming so i just um i kept it and you can see they are starting to kind of get new um new buds on it so i'm thinking that will be okay in here under here um like here -ish, I think I have a new bulb this one and um, this is good the petunia this one is gonna spread according to my mom um, it's called this Ooh. I can't see it this one is a sweet pea um, this is gonna need support um, so I have to kind of organize that and then again this is another one that we had from last year um, but it seems to be growing again and there's another bulb in here so I kind of take these off um, because you know if there is um, new bulb seed going to come off um, I don't want it to be covered um, up here then in my two little I got these guys 
so an amarda white and um, so these prop this isn't a pot of plant this spreads as far as i know um but for now it's just in there and then i got this it's just called an irish mum i think so they sit there and they try to get all of the sun throughout the day it's only really now that the, we're not getting sun like a couple of minutes ago we had sun and um, but the it has changed so for the majority of the day we would have um we would have sun out here we also cleaned it and um, don't mind the bag of rubbish we need to put that down but we took away all of the sand that was down here and um, we sweeped it up we took up we scooped out we took up the board we scooped it all out and we cleaned it so it's all nice out there and it's nice to sit out sit here and kind of like look out and see like the the, the yellow flower the green um for the ones that haven't flowered yet um but yeah some of them need to, are going to spread and then some of them are going to need support like the sweet pea so i do need to organize something that i can support it and seemingly it will go up it or something i'm not really sure um but i'll, I'll figure it out as i go along like i did last year um, last year if you remember I have a fairy garden video um, and a balcony garden makeover video um, and that was my first year ever having plants and the majority of them um, survived until November and then I just kind of was sick of them so from was May to November um, but then I have the two um, that are starting to bloom again from last year and as far as I know they spread as well um so i potentially have a lot of spready flowers um and we'll see how those seeds go but so far they have some sprouting up which i'm really happy about um so we'll keep i'll keep you informed on it today's video um, we've just had dinner spaghetti, spaghetti bolognese is what I was cooking there Ava was starving weren't you did you eat it all yeah now you can have a treat you can have your bunny bits bites bunny bites so Robert's over doing the dishes I'm sitting here and that's the end of today. It is 5 to 6, 10 to 6, 10 to 6 in the evening. Ava's going to bed in an hour. Yeah. You? And then that's it. That's all that's going to happen. So thank you so much for watching today. Please do subscribe if you're new. Give the video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And we will talk to you in the next one. Bye. bye, -bye.